ready for this as we are kicking off morning two here, day two, with a tag team match. First tag team match at the Gold Rush tournament this year, 2018 Gold Rush. And now making his way down to the ring here. Pope Francis on the shop. I have enjoyed being here much better than where we were last year. I, I think I told Ben that we weren't there still. I hope so. Now I'm like, Plus, Bruce Payne is making his way down to the lane. We've already got both of the two of the two of the lane as well. Slick Rick. Bruce Payne is now making his way into the lane. It's going to be Bruce Payne's first match in the tournament. He is going to be going to the tagging match and being able to tag his partner. As it was about to be lit wrestling against BCW, and we want to tag in that. Oh, 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 oh. And that's interesting. BCW did the smart thing, they had the freshman Chris Hunter start out for their team. Slick Rick, on the other hand, for Lit is starting out. For their team, I guess Slick was confident enough after his victory that he wants to start this out. Let Brute Pain keep one guy that's fully fresh here for your brand. I guess it's their idea, but Chris Hunter is making him pay for it now. Lung blower there from Hunter. Of course, same stipulation applies here. The points are just higher, and pin and submission does not make a difference in a tag team match. The winner gets four points. If it ends in a draw, the time limit hits. Then both teams will get two points. It'll be half, of course, of the what you would have got. Both teams will get two then if it ends in a draw. And now these guys are going back and forth with each other. There's a lot better chance I think it'll end in a draw than for tag match, considering the situation here. Considering there's four guys in the match. Which is really going to help UCW out. Considering they got the automatic four points because of the winning the last year's tournament. Of course, this round one will give you give you your placement, I should say, going into round two, which is the war round. Which is where things are gonna get interesting and people are gonna start getting eliminated when they get pinned. Right now, of course, pin submission gives you points. Uh, for point tier here for the round robin, much like we did last year for the full tournament. And now sends him into the corner. Slick Rick in trouble in the corner of BCW. He's able to fight out of it. Right now, Slick is doing a great job here against Chris Hunter. And Slick Rick looking at that rolling elbow. Chris Hunter's too fresh, man. He was able to block it. Slick Rick had a brutal fight yesterday morning with KSJ, the best match of the tournament by far. Slick Rick right now is getting hammered, man. Went for a pile driver. Chris Hunter's having none of it. Now it seems like Hunter and Rex are having some issues with Rex telling Hunter to finish him here. And that's what he looks like he's going for. And is that a wrath of the gods? And now a cover. One, two, Rex messed up, man. He was down. Oh, that was very stupid there for, for Brute Pain. He just messed up royally. He took out the SmackDown ref. Smackdown ref don't need to get hit, he's dumb, as, he's dumb as it is. He doesn't need to get freaking knocked down and get his head rattled. Now we're going to get a butterfly lung blower here, and usually we see Slick Rick doing that. Right now, VCW's not working well together. Rex Strongman telling Chris Hunter to finish it off. Rex already had a match. He doesn't want to have to get back in the ring. Now Chris Hunter's trying to cheat here, use the ropes. Brute Payne's having none of it though. Payne keeps messing things up here for BCW. And Chris Hunter's had enough. He takes out Brute Payne. And now he's got to deal with Slick Rick in the ring though. And Rick counters. Puts him in the corner. Now Slick Rick's working him over. Well, did Chris Hunter realize he just gave Slick Rick and lit the advantage by doing that. Of course, both these teams, funny enough, right now are tied two to two. Oh, no! Right in the pee-pee. 
And Chris Hunter's gonna be feeling that one cutthroat side slam from Hunter. Hunter trying to fire back here. He just got his freaking, he just got his freaking wing wing off though, put it that way. And Hunter spins him around. Chris Hunter now with shoulder tackles in the corner on Slick Rick. And I'm just gonna look to stomp away at him here in the corner. Wait, what is, oh no, I didn't see this one coming. Rex, move out of the way, you idiot. Chris Hunter's climbing on top of Rex now. Hunter, coast to coast. Holy crap. The distance there. Holy crap, and keep in mind, Rex or Brute Payne haven't even gotten the match yet. Chris Hunter tags out, in comes Rex Strongman now. And Slick Rick immediately taking control here. And now looking for a lung blower bomb right away on Rex. No, oh, I think he hit it on the wrong man though. Cover for Slick Rick here. Slick for a cover, one, two. And Rex kicks out at two. That's the first damage that Rex has taken in this match. It's gonna be very difficult to finish this in the 10 minute time limit. These tag matches are gonna be hard to end, I think. The match is already half over, and Rex is just now getting in the ring. But he's already got pretty messed up. And now Slick Rick gonna tag out. In comes Brute Pain. It's gonna be the first time we've seen Brute Pain actually officially in the match. This guy is big, he is intimidating, he's bigger than Rex. Oh Jesus, Rex lit him up there with a strike combo. Brute Pain's having none of it, man. This guy is jacked to the freaking. I want to say gills, but he's not a fish. And Brute Pain is shredded. And Brute immediately got off the ropes, but Rex is just continuing to take it to him. This man is not staying down. Jesus Christ. <laughs> that thing's affecting him. Fisherman suplex. Rex, you better make that tag to Hunter. Holy, literally nothing is affecting this thing. What the hell? This guy is just no-selling everything that he gets hit with. And don't fuck with Brute Pain, look at this. Man, if anyone's gonna win this match, it's going to be Brute right now at this rate. Jesus Christ, Rex needs to cover up Rex. Oh, and right there, luckily enough for his sake, he was able to counter that Blue Thunderbomb. Oh, come on now, once again, VCW trying to cheat here. <laughs> Rex is fighting for his life right now. And now he's got brute pain up. Oh my God, one blower bomb. You know, Slick Rick's not happy, he just seen that. Cover here from Rex, one, two, two count. I'll be, I'll be honest, I'm surprised he even got a... <laughs> what the heck? Like, Rex is lucky right now that he's scouting everything Brute Pain has to offer, otherwise he would have gotten fucked up by now. Bitter in there from Rex Strongman, and he just jacked up Brute Pain. And but this guy has just been no-selling everything, but that bitter end might have done it. Slick Rick needs to make the save here. Two, VZW's going up. No, nope. Brute Pain kicks out. Rex looks furious. I thought he was gonna go there and save Chris Hunter. Chris Hunter's getting messed up there. Butterfly lung blower. And that's exactly what Rex is going over for now. He's distracted there because of Slick Rick. Slick Rick took out Chris Hunter. And we are down inside two minutes left in this. Oh God, German suplex jackknifed him, man. And Brute Payne's not finished with him. I don't know the looks of things anyways. Rex Strongman fights him off. Boom! STO takedown. Cover, one, two. Brute Payne's out of two again. Jesus, they need to finish this in here soon. They've got just over a minute and a, just under a minute and a half left, really. Now Brute lifts him up. This is getting down to the wire, man. Sends him into the corner of Lit. And now, no, right off the boot of Slick Rick. And he just messed up Rex's face there. And Slick Rick 
Oh God, and now of course Litz going to return the favor your feet on the ropes. Steal it in, <laughs> one down. Oh, right hand to the face there from Slick. No, oh, skull crushing finale, god damn. Chris Hunter gets tagged in, 40 seconds left. Hunter's looking to rally. Slick Rick's having none of it, right hand to the face. Chris Hunter counters, 30 seconds. 30 seconds, knee to the back. Slick Rick counters. Rick now, he's got inside 30 seconds. He needs to finish him here, go for a rolling elbow or something. Chris Hunter counters. Spear from Hunter. Now Hunter's called him up. 15 seconds, 14, 13, 12, 11. Wrath of the Gods. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, cover. 5, 4, 3, 2, oh, one second off. have fun Rex has went to the back Hunter after just almost winning that last match has to go one-on-one -on -one now with someone who's going to be completely fresh and that's UCW's Nova Reese I think everyone except for one of IWA's competitors are now competed by now Chris Hunter last match of this debut match what a performance for Hunter he's gonna go one-on-one -on -one with the Nova ball Nova Reese Nova is the multi-time UCW World Champion. Chris Hunter's got to have his work cut out for him. Seen Hunter have a good performance in that tag match. Like I said, he almost won. Rex Gunn, the hot tag. Chris came in there, hit the rest of the dogs. He was one second off from winning that. Give him a two, four points. Now, of course, Rick, DCW, and UCW are all tied at the top right now at four points. UWA has three, IWA still has not gotten the board yet. No one can have that opportunity, though. So, put UCW in the lead. Of course, whoever wins round one is going to get a bye. They will not have to compete in round two. That's going to be a huge opportunity to ever win round one. They will get a bye in round two. They will get to skip round two on to the finals. And the SmackDown Rev rings the bell, and Chris Hunter running right at Nova Reese. He knows he's banged up. He knows he's less than 100% right now. Nova Reese is 100%. He does not want to let Nova get an advantage here. Nova counters. Nicely done. Just no... He took no freaking energy from him there to counter that. Nova Reese, like I said, the 100% right now. Chris Hunter was just in a tag match. Granted, he barely was in the match at all. Rex Strongman took the brunt of the beating. But Nova Reese right now is just flying all over this freaking arena. Said so we don't know anything about Nova Reese other than he's a multi-time champion at UCW. He caught the super kick there from Chris Hunter. And now right into the vintage backbreaker. Randy Orton style backbreaker there. Now Nova sends Hunter off the ropes here. DCW could really use this. These points right now. Put them in the lead. DCW wins and put them in the lead though too. Both these teams are tied right now. Kick the leg. Nova shoves off the cutter there from Chris Hunter. He's going to just kick out the leg. These two going back and forth, man. High knee from Nova Reese. Impressive performance there from the Nova Ball. And now he could be looking to end it. No, oh, jeez, huge jackknife pop-up powerbomb cover. Immediately into the cover, Chris Hunter's out of two. But that's really damaged him. Hunter right now probably has about a 10% chance of winning this after this. Now Hunter looking to follow up. Nova Reese counters elbows to the face. He's had to compete in a tag match. It ended in a draw. So they didn't even get the full four points. They got two. And now he has to compete one-on-one -on -one with Nova Reese, who is quick as hell, man. And now Hunter. Nice. Electric chair into the German suplex. Looking to follow up. Nova Reese shoots the legs. Nova, of course, is going to have the speed advantage over everyone in this damn tournament. 
That is going to be a huge advantage for Nova Reed, as long as he can utilize that single leg high knee again. And he's just rocking Chris Hunter. I think this is the most one-sided match yet in the tournament. And right there, a snap suplex from Chris Hunter. He will kick the back of Nova Reese. Hunter now is trying to build momentum. Gonna lift him up to one knee here. Went to chop him, Hunter. Uh, Nova counters, Nova blocks again. Nova Reese right now is rolling. Neck breaker into the butterfly. Butterfly suplex from Nova Reese. And Nova is just rolling all over Chris Hunter right now. Now possibly looking for another pop-up powerbomb. That's probably got to do. Two. And no, Hunter somehow yet again kicks out too. He's going to have no energy left. I mean, I'm pretty sure he's still got one more match in round one. That's Chris Hunter. He's going to have no... Yeah, the SmackDown ref's checking on Hunter right now. Nova Reese is going to have to compete back-to-back -back as well. But I think he's going to be in pretty good shape right now if this match ends here soon. He might be a little winded, but that's about it. Chris Hunter with a kick to the stomach. And no, not happening. Nova avoided the attack there from Hunter. That's one way to avoid it, man. Oh, now a cross chop across the throat. Stunner! Stunner from Reese. Right in for a cover. Hunter, you're dead. One, two, three. Nova Reese with an impressive performance. I'm not going to lie, that was pretty good. Pretty impressive there from Nova Reese. Taking that single, single flying knee there. Much better than Lewis. Pretty freaking impressive there. Like Chris Hunter got lost. Now Nova's gonna have to stay out here in the ring. Cause he's got IWA up next, I believe. And it's gonna be none of the two bones. Nova, get ready, because we're about to see the final competitor that has not competed yet in the tournament. This, of course, is going to be Keith Bones. Make his way down to the ring here. Keith is the final competitor yet to compete in the gold rush this year. If I was Keith right now, I would definitely be looking to use the power He looks pretty good. He looks pretty strong. I would be... 100% looking to use the power advantage over and over Reese because I don't think there's anyone on the planet that's faster than that. As the one we just seen in the last match, Bruce is 100% going to be looking to use strength against Steve. Of course, Bruce representing IWA. Interesting to see how Cruz goes. And this one, IWA really needs points. If Cruz could pull out a submission here, that would really help him. And Nova Reese beats him and is not looking great for IWA right now. Around one, anyways. SmackDown ref rings the bell. Nova Reese and Cruz. See, I told you Nova Reese is going to be gassed here. Cruz, instead of doing this, he needs to be tackling and taking him down to the canvas, something like that. Cruz, of course, has coined himself a head collector. Will he have Nova Reese's head on a silver platter? Nova counters now. Like I said, you've got to watch out for that speed. That guy is quick as hell, man. And now Nova breaks the grasp. Bit of power display shown there. And now Cruz. With some counters here on Nova Reese as well. Wrenched on the neck of Nova. Oh god, now just chopping at the neck. It'll cut off the circulation to the throat. Oh, that will win Nova even quicker. Now Nova is looking to follow up. Like I said, Nova is gassed right now. Cruz is taking the advantage. 
Nova. No, oh, just got a huge elbow dropped on him from Cruz Bones. Now Bones with a senton right after. Two high impact maneuvers there back to back. Of course, right now UCW's regained the lead six points. Is what UCW has right now. They have a very good chance of winning this round and being able to have a pass through round two. Now looking to follow up there is Nova. Countered Cruz's attempt at some offense. Now Cruz counter whips him into the corner. You've got to be careful though. You're giving Nova re separation here. They're giving him an opportunity to pick up speed. And that's exactly what Nova's going to start to do there. Quick shot to the face. Cruz counter whips him into the corner. Cruz needs to stick on him here. Don't give him any room, man. And now Cruz raking the eyes of Nova. One way to take control. That's cheap as hell, but it'll work. Reverse DT from Cruz Bones. Now Cruz lifting him up. Going for a rolling elbow. And now the playbook of Slick Rick. And now Cruz calling him up to his feet here. He's looking in. Nova. Oh man, no, just plants him into the canvas. Nova could be out here, man. Two, no. A quick win there for Cruz Bones. Like I said, Nova's been gassed this whole match. Now Nova's back up to his feet. No, oh, geez, in the high knee. Man, Cruz didn't watch out for that. He caught him with the high knee. And now Nova's calling him up to his feet. I've got the pop-up power bomb. Plants Cruz Bones. One, two, Nova. No, he about skyrocketed UCW into the lead. And Cruz right now, his legs twitching. Nova just messed him up. And now Nova's rallying here. Double chops across the chest and power slam. Nova Reese right now is rolling, man. Kick to the stomach, stunner. The stunner that he just won the last match with. But Cruz, man, he's too damn big and powerful. He's staying in this. Cruz now shoots the half on Nova Reese. One. Only a one count on Nova. Nearly enough damage done here for Cruz Bones. Now Nova double leg takedown again. Now just a kick to the spine of Cruz. And Nova, how the hell is he 180 in this right now? Bloody Sunday! Bloody Sunday! God damn, they could have just broken Cruz's freaking neck. Nova maybe collecting his head after this. Swagger bomb! Holy crap, gut wrench power bomb from Nova Reese. Is that enough? You haven't seen that yet. And that got him the victory over Cruz as well. What the hell? Holy crap. I think anyone expected Nova to come out here and knock off Cruz as well. And that's skyrocketing UCW into the lead now. Fuck, they're up to eight points. They just doubled BCW and Lit score, man. All thanks to Nova Reese, too. Lewis hasn't done shit yet. Holy crap. Other brands are going to have fun making a comeback off of this. UCW eight points now. Eight freaking points. Nova Reese is definitely the star here this morning. Day two. Holy crap, what a performance there from Nova Reese. 